Alright, I just wanted to take a few moments to address some of the things that are different from the videos that I have posted previously. So I made some changes and I want to make sure that you're aware of those. Uh, if you look here, I have week two open because this is what it'll look like each week throughout the semester. Um, the only difference is our first week here as we're getting to know things. So recall that uh, as outlined in the syllabus, you have your lecture notes that are due each week, your homework assignment that's due each week, your quiz that's due each week, and your lab assignment to do each week. So here are your lecture videos, here are your lecture notes, so it's split up by chapter one and two this week, and notice that the due date is January 24th. So the due date for all four assignments that are due each week is by that Sunday, so that's January 24th for this week, so due by January 24th, the homework assignment is due by January 24th. The quizzes are due by January 24th. And the lab assignment is due by January 24th. The exception, the things that I have changed, is that the peer reviews are now due the week after that. So they'll be due every week after the assignment was turned in. So you turn in the homework assignment on January 24th. Then that will, after January 24th at 11.59 p.m., you have access to the reviewer points assignment, which is where the peer review key is. Um, that will open up at that time, and then you'll have the ability to complete that peer review, which you would do here, using this answer key from here, and complete that by January 31st. That's your due date for the peer review points assignment. Now, keep in mind that when you complete your peer review, it will still not say anything is graded or completed or done for this assignment. This is kind of a placeholder where I will then input your score based on how well you do the peer review. Okay, so um, just keep in mind that it will still say missing or not turned in or, or have a dash or whatever until I grade your peer review and I put in the points. So I do want to click on this for just a minute. You'll see that this is the, the homework assignment. When this is open and available, if I click on this, <clears throat> you'll see that here's the key. So it's due by January 31st, so it tells you how many points, um, and then you have until then to complete it. So this is the answer key in both uh, .doc and .pdf that you need to use in order to complete your peer reviews. So make sure that you use those, and then once you grab the key here, you can go back to the homework assignment, and then here is where you'll, up here you'll see a peer review option, and then you will use the rubric and choose the correct things like the tutorial states in the peer review um, section. So you will submit that and make sure that that's due by that following Sunday. Do keep in mind that if you do not turn in this homework assignment by the due date, you will then not have access to a peer review to grade. Um, so that means that you will miss out on the points for the assignment as well as the points for the peer review. So please do keep that in mind that if you don't turn one in, you do not get to do a peer review.